164 yards per game. The Brownies are giving up almost that many. And there's a first down catch by Cole Beasley. They'll move the chains, and we moved L.A. to check the trade and embraced his role with the Browns. He just wants to play football. That's all he wants to do, and he did on that play. Second down at 13, and Prescott rolls out to his right. That's Beasley inside the 35, and he's about a yard or two short of a first down. Let's go back to L.A. And into the backfield alongside Prescott. Beasley. Escaping Williams in the corner, and that's a touchdown for the Cowboys. The Browns know they love Des Bryant, so they're going to pay extra attention to Des Bryant in the red zone, which allows Cole Beasley to be patient in his route. And again, a strike. Watch here. Des Bryant will take two, allowing Cole Beasley on the easy outcut. A confusion here with Williams and Tremont Williams. I mean, yep. that, that's what you, and, and uh, Joe Hayden. You're right, uh, Tom. I, that shouldn't that have been a, what you call a banjo call? That's a banjo. It's a me you. Me, so. me you. Who you take him if he comes to the out? I take him if he comes to the outside. You take him if he comes to the inside. And neither one of them plays between wins and losses. Yeah. Absolutely. Now, boys, five out of six on third down. They get six out of seven. Beasley to the 42. Cole Beasley is the leading receiver of these Dallas Cowboys from Little Elm, Texas. Remember in the first half we talked about pressure? Okay, would Cleveland bring extra guys to try and get it? Well, they did. And look how Lance Dunbar helps pick it up. And he steps in there, stays in there, and throws a strike downfield to Cole Beasley. See Dak Prescott? He was getting straight games. That is the longest streak at any time by any rookie in the Super Bowl era. And the yards just keep on coming. They convert again on third down. So after that personal foul, they put it in the hands of Beasley. Got a block from Tyron Smith.